They could be sunning on the beach, but some Miami athletes are spending this summer sweating out the tough game of city kids. They're not just playing to win, they're going for something better. Just ask the boys of Flamingo Park. Reed Galen reports. Plato called old age a dreary solitude. You see a lot of that around Miami Beach. Frailty and loneliness. But in the middle of it all is an island of vigorous defiance. It's what you have to do when you're over 60. <laughs> Flamingo Park, home of the wall. Where old men come to show others and themselves and mortality itself that they have not yet worn out. 45 years ago, my doctor bowled the hell out of me for playing handball. <laughs> And they're all, now they're all dead, and I'm still playing handball. <laughs> They've lost all grace. <laughs> but with every halting, sweat-soaked swat, men in their 70s and 80s, with names like Danny the Legend, Fast Eddie, The Brain, and Jake the Plumber, retrace the steps of their youth. In the great gray cities of the Northeast, handball was the game they grew up with. A tough game, without pads, like life. Every, every ball you miss, just keep quiet. You yeah, make a lot of noise, you don't say anything. Most started out poor. The only thing they didn't have to earn in their lives was old age. But it has not come without a fight. This is just the beginning. I got to put on my knee brace, I got my back brace on. I'm a walking mess. How old are you? 65. I'm, I'm the youngest one down here. I'm a kid in the park. They refuse to act their age. Bypass surgery scars crisscross many a chest here on the court they call the oven, where temperatures reach 115 degrees. I don't play lotto, lotto I don't play bingo, so I says, don't call me. I, my number's not up. When I stop playing handball, then my days are numbered. Soon, the oven may be empty. Young people don't grow up swatting handballs anymore. It's become, ironically, an old man's game. And when they have all finally worn out, who will pick up the ball and remember? Well, the boys of Flamingo Park are too busy cheating time to spend a lot of their precious energy worrying about the future. Hey, don't push. Don't push. Reed Galen, CBS News, Miami Beach. I was the one in the pink shorts.